Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Isaksan and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing season one, episode 10 of Sailor Moon called The Curse Bus. Enter Mars, the Guardian of Fire. So we start off with Beryl is getting upset with um, Jedi for not finding the crystal and for the energy <laughs> not happening either. Then we cut to Usagi, sees police cars, and runs into Ami, and they're doing research to find the princess. Uh, Ami was. She, Usagi's reading, like, manga and stuff. She ain't doing that. Then we cut to where they overhear about a uh, bus disappearing, and they call it the curse, six o'clock bus. And so they go to the temple to get an amulet, or amulet. And then it's Hakawa. I'm pretty sure I'm butchering that shrine. And we find out that Jedi is working there and he's selling like love charms and stuff like that. And then Ray's grandpa is a big weirdo slash salesman. And then Usagi thinks, um, he thinks that Usagi is pretty and, um, the girls start to feel weird. And then Ray accidentally hit Usagi and then Katora's lady fusses out Ray. And she shuts her down, like, you can go. Like, the very couple of the police, they didn't have anything. You can go now. Bye-bye. Like, get out. And then, um, uh, then Usagi's feeling better, because she kind of got knocked out. <laughs> then Luna tells Usagi to get Ami, and basically there's weirdness with the girls waiting for her, the bus. Then Usagi refuses to get on the bus, and the bus driver drives off, and then goes through the portal. Then Usagi goes to talk to Rei, and she's very rude to Usagi, and then Katara Luna left her a red pin. And then we find out that the love ambulance are behind it, and then Rei doesn't trust Jedi, and then Katara Luna uh, gets Usagi on the bus with the disguise pin as like a airline attendant, which makes no sense. Oh, my battery's dying fun. So anyway, um, crap. So they go, and but Ami's too late, and then Rey confronts Jedi, and he sends her through the portal where Usagi's already in the portal, so Usagi transforms. Then Rey starts glowing, because she got the monsters holding her up, and her face, her forehead is glowing with Mars. So uh, Luna says to use the pin, and then Usagi gets the R failed, and so Rey transforms into Sailor Mars. Then obliterates it, and then the portal's closing, so Ami is keeping it up and thanks for her powers. And somehow Tetsuda Mass shows up and takes the buses back with the buses, and that was the end of the episode. I give it an A, just because Tetsuda Mass just sat back and did nothing, and I was like, mm, how did you even get there? I don't understand. It was weird. Anyway, that's going to do for this video. So, this video, please go to like, comment down below, tell me what you think, do you agree, disagree, tell your thoughts down below. Don't forget to subscribe, because that's all the channel a lot, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye! Wow, that was fast, dude. <laughs>